Yo, what's up guys? It's Xander Gunning and today we've got a brand new video. I'm going to be unboxing back-to-back -back Nike sneakers and Nike sneaker W's on this channel. So stay tuned right after this. <laughs> So, like I said in the intro, back-to-back -back sneaker W's. My mom took a W on the Sakai Vapor Waffles. No, the Sakai LD Waffles. And then I took a W on the Nike Dunk Low Retro in the white and gray fog colorway. Got a size 10 right here. A personal size. I know the resale is going nuts on these. The markup's crazy from a retail price of 100 plus free shipping to a resale price of about 275 um on stock x and goat some sites even have them for 300 bucks i just don't see how they're worth that much but for 100 bucks honestly can't find a better deal so i gotta get open these i low-key cheated you know what i'm saying i already looked at these but they're really really good i had to look at them to make sure that i was keeping or not but i kind of knew before the video that i was keeping them so right here you right off the bat you see this all leather shoe you have the gray panels you have the white panels then you have this uh, really nice, like, it's not really nice. I mean, it's standard, you know, mesh material on the inside. You have your standard cotton insole. Actually, it's not cotton. It's actually mesh. So it's like a skating shoe, obviously. So that's mesh on the inside. It says Nike. On the back, it says Nike, and it's embroidered in this embroidered lines. Honestly, one of my favorite details about uh, Nike Dunks. I also love the shape of the toe box. It's pretty, like, fat. It's, it's a nice-looking shoe from... Uh, the top view it looks like that you know so i can also do it like that that's what it looks like on foot that's pretty neat uh the laces are cool they have a uh interesting touch to them you can see like the integrated speckles of like glitteriness even though this is a men's release that's pretty cool they added the metallic touch it's very uh like a it, it looks like a luxurious dunk it's very simple but then the little flare of the laces i might add cream or white laces so comment down below if you think i should do that and if you think I should uh, just, you know, rock these. So I, I'm, I'm definitely rocking these though, but that's on the ground, like how I should I rock these, but there's the shoe right here. A lot of cool fits coming up with these. As far as sizing goes, they fit pretty true to size. Honestly, a size 10 is like, I still have a lot of space in them. I thought I was gonna need a 10 and a half because the Jordan ones and Jordan one lows, I'm a 10 and a half. But I went with a 10 on these because I'm not really sure I've never had dunks in my personal size. So I went with a 10 and that was actually perfect because a 10 and a half would have been crazy and the creasing would have been nuts. Um, but like right out of the box, you can see like already like a little bit of creasing on the sides, but these things are going to get heavily beat. So if you guys don't roast me because they're my personal pair. So yeah, but very excited about this cob. Very excited about a W. You don't get W's a lot anymore on the sneakers app, especially on dunks. So very happy about this. Uh, low key a short video, but you know, I'm going to have a, on foot shot right here, so stay tuned. See this in 3D, all lights out for me, all lights out for me, lightning strikes the beach. So, anyways, thank you guys for watching this video. Hope you guys enjoyed the on foot portion. If you guys have any questions about sizing, resale, or anything like that down below, uh, feel free to ask. Feel free to DM me at Sandra Gunning or add my snap, um, X Gunning. So thank you guys. Stay blessed. Peace.